Hey guys, what is up? The Jeff Meister bringing gameplay commentary of Soldier Front 2. Um, this is actually a shotgun gameplay on the map Bizarre. Um, there's this one guy in the lobby named uh, I Tyler, I believe. Um, the previous screen's kind of small, but yeah, I kind of remember. Um, and like, this is like the first or second game that we ended up on the same team. Um, and basically, like, We've been going back and forth sniping each other, so now that we're on the same team, I just thought, screw it, and I'll just pull out my shoddy, mess around with it, because, uh, I don't know. Uh, I kind of like shotguns, but, you know, they're kind of weak, like, really weak. Um, it's a two-shot, unless it's a headshot, pretty much. Um, don't rely on, you know, body one-shots, because they just don't happen. Um, unless you're point-blank like that guy, but that never happens, so... Yeah, except for that one time. It rarely happens. It's not consistent, so don't go. F so don't expect like one shot body shots. Always expect the follow up, or just go for a headshot. And uh, yeah, it does have a fair distance though. Like, see that? It has a pretty okay range. It's not. It's not terrible, but it's just that like, it's not as useful compared to other weapons because other weapons can just you know headshot somebody anyway, and the headshot is pretty much a guaranteed kill. Um, so what that means is, with a shotgun, you pretty much have to just overwhelm them. You have to get up close and you have to just overwhelm them, because this thing, what it does is it makes it easier to get the headshot. Because you're firing like 8 or so pellets, I don't know how many pellets, like 8, 10, 12, something like that. You're firing pellets off in a, in a wide cone, so you just need to get like one of those off into the head to get a kill. Um, but, you know, if you can't get that, then two shots, you know, two clean meat shots is more than enough to kill him. Um, it is pretty satisfying. I really like this weapon. Thing is, um, the hit markers are kind of weird. I don't know how they actually work. Um, and they are kind of weird. But, hey, whatever. Um, what you have to do with shotguns in this game is kind of play passively aggressively. Passively aggressively. Um, you have to get up in there, but you shouldn't be rushing them. You should be getting up into a position in which they'll be running into you because um, it's a very close range weapon you'll need them to run it you, you'll need them to run into you because you know if you run at them head on you're gonna get destroyed because you know it's not that great a weapon see so like, like that you kinda wanna be in a cover position or just around a corner um, so they don't expect you um, and then when they when they pop around or when they just come into your line of sight you just you know get off one or two easy shots and they're dead. Shotguns are actually pretty fun. It's just that, like, they're kind of weak. See, it's three shots from that kind of range. Um, although, I could have gotten it a lot cleaner. And, you know, they do feel kind of weird. Um, like, you don't really know quite what's going on. Um, they feel weird. Um, like, it's not something I can really explain, but, like, something that you, can, you, you have to kind of just shoot it yourself to kind of get a hold of to get you know uh to know really because it's it's weird to the point where it's a bit unsettling but it's not you know um crippling to my enjoyment of this weapon um yeah and here i get swarmed i don't know where this guy came from like he came out my ass or some shit but uh didn't get the headshot so he he kills me and takes my gun that's what happens when you when you don't get the headshot you just get destroyed because you need the headshot uh, this guy's just camping here. I didn't actually see him. Um, and there's another guy camping around the other corner. Um, they are some next level corner campers this game. Um, and they're not even doing it with a shotgun. Like, I could excuse corner camping with a shotgun because the, the shotgun is a giant, you know, it's pretty stupid in this game. It's it's pretty gimpy. Um, if you use a shotgun, you're pretty much handicapping yourself because you're taking away a lot of your range without giving you too much close quarter power. Because, like, at times to kill with the shotgun, you know, the two body shots is no it isn't that much shorter than like the four shots needed with an AR. So, yeah. Um I mean, I use it because it's nice and I just like shotguns. Um they're satisfying. Um they're also kind of silly. Um I just like using underpowered weapons kind of. Um I was all, or just shotguns. I I just have a soft spot for shotguns really. I love shotguns. Shotguns are nice weapons. There's some good shit. <clears throat> All right. Oh yeah, Soldier Front Two. The games are kind of short. That's one thing I like. Um, I like the the kind of brevity. Like the commentaries 
are kind of short so I can kind of focus on, on, the com uh, on the content of the video a bit more. Like, it's not as scattered. Like, I'm not as pressed to fill up time as I am with the Blacklight videos. And that's just the nature of Soldier Front, really. It's like, the TDMs are 5,000 points, but they go by so much faster. Uh, the spawn delay is kind of short, and the maps are, you know, short, uh, small, and you kind of just get up in each other's faces a lot. And this guy, like, I get two body shots off, but he doesn't die. Um, because, like, what's it called? Shotgun's just shitty, really. <laughs> it's not that great, but, um, it's fun. I like it. The game's over now, so, uh, I'll see you next time.